May is National Skin Cancer Awareness Month. One young man's story might make you think twice about skipping that sunscreen before you head out the door. CBS News reporter Joy Howe just got back from Epworth and joins us now with his incredible journey. Yeah, we talk about skin cancer cases all the time, but what makes this skin cancer story so unusual is this young man's age. Will O'Brien was so young, in fact, doctors in Iowa City sent him to a Texas hospital because they hadn't seen a case like this in 25 years. I'll, this is him in the hospital getting his treatments. Will O'Brien has a scrapbook. He's one of my best friends and we had a lot of great times together. It's filled with memories from a journey that started five years ago. Mom sat our whole family down in the living room. Mom Melissa says it's a miracle that one day her young son overheard a conversation his dad was having about getting a mole checked out. I know that my mole has changed too so I thought I'd say something. I asked for the pathology report and you could read it there that said treat for aggressive melanoma with close clinical follow-up. I'll always remember those words. Skin cancer at nine years old. Doctors blew them away. Were baffled. After a visit to a Dubuque dermatologist who sent them to Iowa City where they said they hadn't seen a case so young in at least 25 years, he ended up at a skin cancer facility in Texas. I probably wasn't as scared as I should have been. All I said was now is Patrick going to be nicer to me, my brother? <laughs> to me, it gave me hope that we're still going to be normal. You know, <laughs> we're still going to be our family. Three operations later, followed by a year of treatment and chemo, this normal family is doing something extraordinary. We got to do something positive about this. They and others founded Outrun the Rays, a nonprofit group that hosts a run every year. Kind of makes me feel that, like, I'm not the only one, that there's a lot more people. We would love to make it be that sunscreen becomes like seat belts. You wear your seat belt and you wear sunscreen. This young man has proved where there's a will, no matter what age, there's a way. Putting on sunscreen is a lot easier than going through what, it, what happens if you don't. Good to see Will Cancer Free now, and this year's Outrun the Rays race is coming up on May 23rd, and they'd love to get 500 racers, and you can register online. We'll put a link on our website, and don't forget your sunscreen. Joy Howe, CBS2 News, live at 5.